Hey guys, this is Chris from Missouri. I do a ton of fishing from land, and when it comes to fishing from land, the name of the game is being able to make long casts to reach fish that other people can't reach. Uh, I do a lot of fishing from the pier, from the jetties, a lot of surf fishing, especially this time of year in the late fall into the winter and early spring. Uh, two of the baits that I want to talk to you about today that I catch a lot of fish on from land and also from the boat when I need to make long casts is the Hydromental LC as my swimming plug and then the Surface Cruiser as my topwater. Uh, starting with the Hydromental LC, it's a, it was a new bait for 2018, specially designed for fishing particularly in the surf. So this is the larger size, six and three quarters and an ounce and three quarters, and the smaller size is six inch and an ounce and a quarter. So these baits have an elongated skinny shape. They'll fly through the wind really well. They have that heavier weight, but the biggest thing is that great weight transfer system for casting. So that weight snaps to the back of the bait at the back of your cast when you're going forward and it'll fly straight through the wind. So if you're fishing a heavy surf day, in that you know 20 mile an hour headwind you can shoot this bait through the wind really well it's got that small lip so it swims with a real wide wobble and it'll swim real shallow all the way back to you so you can fish it all the way back in the whitewash or fish it above the rocks along the edge of the jetty um, it's a bait that i've caught snook tarpon um, it's great for you know species like bluefish mackerel and big jacks and things like that when you need a swimming plug and something you can cast a long ways to reach those fish Great hooks, you don't need to switch anything out. One of the, my favorite all-time Yozuri baits is the Yozuri Surface Cruiser. So the Surface Cruiser is a pencil popper. It's got a lot of weight in the back of the bait, so it casts a long ways. This is the larger size, the uh, seven inch size, and this is the smaller size. Um, you know, ounce and a half on the smaller size, over two ounces on the larger side, so they come with a lot of weight. Real solid foam material, you can't break this bait. Uh, 4x trebles, so no issue there. How I like to fish the surface cruiser is, I'll, it depends on the species that I'm looking for. So down here in Florida this time of year, we're fishing for bluefish along the beach. I'll fish it with a long pop, you know, long sweep of the rod, and it kind of has a pop with a skipping type action on the surface. I fish it slower, but if I find a big school of jack crevals or something, or you know, even in the summer if I'm fishing for bonitas or blackfins or some other kind of tuna where they're chasing bait and really pushing bait real hard. I'll throw it way out in front of the school and basically just burn it along the surface. And it has a skipping action along the surface like a ballyhoo um, or, or a mullet or something like that that's fleeing the bait fish. You can reel it as fast as you want. It'll skip really well and the fish will run it down. The other way to fit, that I'll fish it is it actually sits in the water like this and it'll walk. Not with a traditional side to side like you would with a pencil bait, but more with a up and down slapping action kind of side to side. It's a great action to work because you can vary the speeds, you can do it fast, you can do it slow, and it'll walk in a, in a two or three foot chop because it's got the head up style of walking. Uh, great casting bait um, because of the shape and the weight in the back of the bait where you can make some really long casts and get some really great top water uh, blow ups on this bait in particular. Um, what, how I like to fish when I'm fishing from, when I'm trying to make long casts from shore, Kind of the sweet spot for me is a nine foot rod. So I fish a nine foot one piece. Um, I fish a medium sized spinning reel and I have got it filled with 40 pound test uh, Yozuri Super Braid. I usually fish at 60 or 80 pound fluoro, top knot fluoro leader, three foot is plenty. No terminal tackle, just a line to line connection. Um, I use a uni to uni connection, works for me. And uh, I'll fish a snap at the end so I can switch from a top water to swimming bait back and forth pretty easily. Um, that setup, can, you know, something I use from land on the, on the pier, on the beach, on the jetty, works for a variety of species in a variety of conditions. On the boat, I'll downsize the rod, same setup, but I'll downsize the rod to an eight foot rod so I can make some really long casts from the boat, sight fishing to schools of fish, you know, up and down the beach when we're running the beach in the boat. So check these out at your local retailers. They're available at pretty much any of the good dealer shops on the east coast of Florida, up in the northeast for you striper and bluefish guys, and even down in Southern California for you calico and yellowtail guys. And they're available online at any of the good online saltwater retailers. Check them out.